Egon, remind me. Why are we driving aimlessly in the fog? The final note, Venkman. Close it, and we seal the mandala, trapping the ghosts inside. Sorry to break this to you, Egon, but I just don't see a mandala... You were saying? Shandor Island. It's here. Drop you guys in circle. If Ecto-8 sinks, we're sunk too. Ray, since you're the most excited about going to Ghost Island, why don't I just take the boat? I, I, I thought I was making a nice gesture. You're giving me the suspicious look. <laughs> Drop it instantly. Let's get going, because nobody enjoys rushing headlong towards their death more than this fellow. What's the story behind this place, Egon? The Shandors owned this island for generations. The castle was built in the 1860s. Evo Shandor used it as a refuge, a lab, and a temple for he and other cult members to worship Gozer. Ooh, okay, that's all well and good. But can someone explain to me how an entire island sinks? The night the last Shandor died, there was a huge tidal surge, and the river just swallowed the island whole. Shandor consecrated the island to Gozer, and the ghost world reclaimed it. <laughs> City's luck is in the middle of the river instead of Rockefeller City. We're lucky now. Soon the ghost world will continue to assert itself into ours, and the damage will be incalculable. Hmm. Just another screwed up day of the office. Good idea. Look at that. Rookie, move the crane. Start swinging around. Almost. Work it over this way to cover the hole. Bring it in. Almost there. Whoa. Great. Yo, new guy. Good work. Hands up. You all right? What's with you? You know you only get paid if we live. Recruit, you okay? Let's keep moving. Careful, we don't wear helmets. Guys, there's way too much dangerous debris falling in here. I've got to take Marine Ecto-8 out where it's safer. Don't go too far, Ray. If we need you, we're gonna need you really fast. Aye, aye, Z. Raise me on the horn if you need me. Now he's Captain Ahab. Be careful, Ray. Let's keep moving. We'll find a place where Ray can put in to get us later. Check this joint out. That's a $3 million view, even by Manhattan standards. My apartment used to look like this. Shandor's public architectural style ranged from federal to art deco. His personal tastes, however, obviously lean toward the Gozerian. Oh, now I see what they mean by early demonic. sound good. There's an open door. Hey, we know those guys. Ah, 
that explains why they attacked us in Times Square. They're gargoyles from Shandor buildings. Gazebo would be tickled pink to know his old security system still works so long after he died. That's a lot of whatever they are. Hey, you. You're up, buddy. Okay, Cadet. You first. I've got your back. Did you know that historically hedge mazes are designed to conceal a secret shortcut? Well, there's still one crank that works down there. Try using it to open the door. Let's get a scan. Let's keep moving. Find the chain! Find the chain! Winston, can we get out of here? That did it! The door's wide open! Get back up here! Keep moving. We're not welcome. Yeah? There's a first. I'm gonna get us all name badges that say, Hello, I'm not welcome. Or maybe t-shirts or coffee mug.
Alyssa, I see her. You and me both. She's wearing just a simple terry cloth robe. And she's brought me coffee. That's her, all right. Spitting image. The resemblance is uncanny. This is Evo Shandor's mother, painted in 1885. Wait. What? Alyssa is a Shandor? Why does this always happen to me? I meet a girl, she's crazy about me, but she always turns out to be some kind of unbelievable fixer-upper! This is all making sense. Alyssa must have inadvertently triggered the mandala because she has Shandor blood. And she doesn't know it. When I did her profile, she told me she was adopted. Some coincidence, huh? You don't really believe this happened by accident. No. Someone must have known and set this up. The mayor did say that Peck personally recommended Alyssa to be the guest curator of the Gozer exhibit. Once a Peck, always a Peck. Shandor must have employed hundreds of workers for years to build this place. The supports are waterlogged, the mortar is decrepit, and the foundation is shattered. In purely physical terms, there's no way all this can still be standing. You sound like you're surprised. No, not really. It's beautiful in a horrific way. You can't deny the pure genius of Shandor. It's a pity that it was all used for evil. If he would have just channeled some of it for good, the things he could have done. A mandala! Posthumous black mess. What? People still worshiping? Even after they're dead? That's a powerful church, man. That might explain how these structures are still standing. Oh, yeah. Ethereal stability induced by sheer focused concentration of posthumous will. Unbelievable. Yeah, right. Unbelievable. What's unbelievable is that you can still use that word in context.
This is great! It's officially time for us to go. Check this joint out. Unless my sensory array is malfunctioning, that is definitely the place we're looking for. Hey, where'd the caddy go? Yo, cool breeze. Come on out. Peter, behind you. No! Get back! Take your imaginary hands off me, man! No, there's too many.
trapped in a dark place. I can barely move my arms. Can you find me? I think you're getting closer to me. The sounds are getting louder. You know, I always did like you more than the others did. Keep looking, man! I've got to be around somewhere in here. Thanks, man. I was seriously cramping up in there. This is all looking a little familiar. Ray would be giggling right now. This must be where all the mood slime came from. Look, they must have pumped it straight into the sewers from here. Let's go find Egon. Then we'll think about finding people. this Shandor's cult was working some crazy experiments in here. There's blue slime, pink slime, yellow slime, but every ghost in here is coated with black slime. What's generating it all? Where's it all coming from?
stuff that really shows well on your review. I think you're really turning some heads back in headquarters. Man, what are these spooks up to? I get the whole Mandela immortality and power, but what's up with all the snipes? This island's got to be sitting directly on a cross-dimensional port. I think I hear you guys. Yes, that sounds like my equipment. You're getting close. Almost to you. Thank you. This is going to reflect well on your performance review. In most cases, I find close proximity to milieu stimulating. That was a little much. Have you seen that? Well, you know. What do you look for him? Well, you know. The meter seems to indicate that he's somewhere in this direction. Machinery indicates an astounding level of sophistication. Pure evil notwithstanding, Evil Shandor was far ahead of his time. You know I have to take my hat off to Shandor? This lab was built how many years ago? It's truly impressive. It's likely Shandor was the parapsychology expert of his time. Stay in the light, Egon. I'm trying, Winston. Should we try to find Peter, or...? They probably stashed him around here somewhere. Help! Yo, a little help! I think I hear it. 
Did somebody call a break? Yep, that's Binkman, all right. Now, we're sure about this, right? We need to be at full strength to shut down this node. Way to go! I feel a momentum swing here in our favor. Get out there and find the Mandala node and shut it down. That should really piss someone off. Hey, I got places to go people to meet. Can we move out of here? Great job, kid. Glad to hear Peter's okay. What are they doing? The readings are as big as those at the library when we crossed over. I think it's safe to assume that the machine they're working on was not built for a benign purpose. It's an orrery, a device typically used for predicting planetary alignment. In this case, it appears to actually be aligning dimensions. I, for one, do not want the dimensions to align. Not this close to Christmas. That would put a damper on the holidays. How do we shut that thing down? The motion of those devices seems to be generating some sort of energy. Hard to tell, though. What if we tried locking those things down? I can calculate 54 likely outcomes. We'd survive three of them. That beats our usual odds. Unfortunately, you're correct. Let's do it. It looks like the movement of those spheres is stabilizing the interior structure. What if they stopped moving? So far, this Gooby Island has been a slime tether amusement park. Why should that change now? Lock those spheres down, man! We gotta stop those balls from moving. I mean, you know what I mean. Smart enough to use science, always try to take over the universe, huh? Egon, Ray, anyone? Didn't think so. Wait, those planets are aligning. I'm not so sure this is the safest course of action. I think we found the source of the black slime, Winston. I wasn't that curious! The whole room's filling up! Get to higher ground! All right, gentlemen, it's official. This was a bad idea. like the Fulton fish market when you've got fish. Wait, I know that, Mr. Putrid mass of hatred, bile, and anger. Not exactly Mr. Sunshine, is it? This is the part where we do what we do. Love it, Doctor. Yo! Hit him in the eyes! His eyes, Rookie! We've got to cut off his visor. Somebody chop some onions. Giving you the evil eye, huh? Statistically speaking, that's not entirely accurate. 
statistically speaking, we better hope it is. Okay, fair enough. What about that inaccessible anterior nodule? That glowing thing on his head? That is his head, isn't it? I'm not sure that matters. How can we get to it? Hey, Rook, run around and look delicious, will ya? There it is. Concentrate your fire on that nose. Hit it right there. It doesn't like that at all. He's taking the bait. Why are you shooting everything but the glowing thing on his head? They belong. Our boy Evil Shadow didn't factor in that he was messing with the Ghostbusters. Ha ha ha! Yep, that made the same mistake. We're gonna have to have a long talk with him. Don't forget that Peter's girlfriend is a Shandor. I'm gonna have a very long talk with her. You guys need to get down to the shore and fast! I don't know how much longer I can hold her. The whole island's sinking! Ray, keep the motor running! We are coming at you fast! Like, did you get any samples? Did it have multiple eyes? Shut up. Oh, thank God you're here. What's going on, Janine? Where's Alyssa? She's gone. They took her. One minute everything was fine, the next it was chaos. Ghosts flying everywhere. Janine, slow down. Start from the beginning. Okay. Well... I was a little late this morning because one of the heels on my favorite pair of pumps broke, and Lester's was out of my favorite tea. You know how I love my chamomile. Well, and... Okay. Maybe not the beginning. Start where things went haywire around here. Okay. Okay. Somebody jumped me from behind. And before I passed out, I heard Alyssa struggling and yelling, Now! And the last thing I remember was the screams of the dead and damned echoing in my brain. So I thought there was a mass escape from Rikers. Or someone shut down our containment grid again. Again? Just like Peck threatened to do. It's funny. I always knew that Peck was a pencil neck bureaucratic prick. But I never pegged him as an evil occultist. But where did he take her? And where are all the ghosts? Cause, no offense, but if all the ghosts we've ever caught just escaped, I'm clocking out. Yeah, they would be awfully mad at us. Exactly. It's generally a bad idea for the guards to hang out in the cell blocks just after a prison break. This just in. As authorities continue to supervise the Thanksgiving evacuation of Manhattan, increasingly powerful tremors are rocking Central Park. The question is, where are the Ghostbusters? Uh, tell you what, kind of a nice day. Why don't we go to Central Park? Could round up some ghosts, say the girl. Get back in time for a nap. Okay, the Ghostbusters ride again.